Alright guys, we're back with Let's Play Assassin's Creed 3. Where we left off, Connor just like pretty much one boss attack on George Washington. Like, that's the last victory you're gonna get, Georgie. It's peace, see ya, whatever. And now we're just looking at them in like blue slow motion. Trying to like pro process it all. And now we're Connor, we're chilling. Connor's already like, I'm gonna take you down, Charles Lee. Something's happened, Desmond. Abstergo has your dad. What? Where? Italy. Same place they were holding you. What are you two waiting for? Let's go. There's more. What? Hello again, Mr. Miles. Okay, I hope this message finds you well, or as well as it can, all things considered. It appears we now each have something the other desires. I propose a trade. Bring me the apple, and I'll return your father to you no worse for the wear. Should you refuse, he will still be returned, albeit much worse for the wear. I assume you'd like to avoid an unpleasant outcome. I always knew it would come to this. Just not so soon. I wonder if Abstergo even knows what's about to happen. And has this been a part of their plan all along? Maybe they want the world to end. To see it all burned away. Maybe. Then they'd have their new world. Ripe for the reshaping. We talked about looking for another power source. Leaving him there. It's probably what he'd want. For us to finish the mission. But I can't. It's hard enough taking a life, but letting one be taken? Knowing there was something I could do about it? Not a chance. Might be I'm risking my life. Risking all our lives to save an asshole. I know, right? What else am I supposed to do? And that asshole my is my dad. Indeed. They're like, whatever. We're not gonna say nothing. We're just gonna let you talk. Pretend that you're like awesome. They're probably holding your father on the upper level. Same place they kept you. There's an elevator bank down the hall. Try not to let them see you. They know I'm here, Rebecca. There's no way they don't. This? This was a bad idea. <laughs> yeah, everybody's like staring at me. It doesn't help that like your your secret blade is like on the outside. Hand over your weapons and come with me, sir. I can show myself in, but thanks for the offer. I'd rather this not turn ugly, Mr. Miles. Then let me through. Subdue the subject, please. You really think they can? Where's my father? <laughs> You'll see him soon enough. Now be a good boy and wait for security to fetch you. Nah, I don't You're gonna have to climb the rest of the way. <sighs> you know me already, dude? I'm Desmond, alright?
Need eyes on him. He can't be far. Where the hell is he? <laughs> Get out. See ya. Your dad could be anywhere, Desmond. Sorry, but I just don't know where he is. I'll find him, don't worry. That's okay. I do. Ugly. No. Back in my old chamber. Give me the apple. No. Let's not draw this out. You got nowhere to go, and I've got a gun. <laughs> Speaking of which. It's the 21st century, and you're still running around with only a tiny knife for protection? <laughs> it's stupid. All right, Desmond. They're stupid. Shouldn't have came this close, dude. Game's over. Not now. Not now. What? Yes, not what the hell is going on down there? You got a gun. You... You killed him! Daniel yeah, was did. like a son to me. <laughs> Sick to your son, perhaps, but not full of promise. You come to me. You come to me. So well, and now you've taken him from me. From our... Yeah. Lucy, we 
want now, to Lucy, help want the it. world, Desmond. No, you don't. To save it from itself. <laughs> you keep stepping in the way. All our hard work. Oh, you're a fanatic. All your kind. Maintaining the erroneous belief that we are evil. That the work we do is wrong. We enrich lives here. We save and transform them. No, you, you don't. You just keep faith and take what isn't yours! <laughs> Wow, there's infamously bad shot. When it comes to punching, they're perfectly fine at doing that. Ow. Not so fast, Mr. Miles. In case you hadn't noticed, I'm the one calling the shots. Now give me the apple. You want it? Fine. Here it is. Oh, Wait. Snap. we got no. the apple's powers. Goodbye. Ah. Got all about that. I'll tell your power with the apple right there. You never should have come here. You put everything on the line for what? So you could rescue your father? Yeah. It's blood, man. Now see, since he's dead, who's the top dogs of the upstairs go now? Is it those people? Front door, and I, it's all good. And is nigh. I'd get the power source hooked up before heading back into the Animus, but it's your call. Yeah, where do I hook them up at, though? Because I forgot.
just stood there and watched me fall to my death. I regret not asking you to hack into the Abstergo servers while you were there. A couple of well-placed relays and we'd be swimming in information. We have everything we need. Yeah, except the key. We're close. How do you know? I just do. Yeah, I'm psychic, alright. I know this stuff. Don't hate, just appreciate. Exactly. I have to hook these things up at, but okay. Hey Desmond, didn't Subject 16's His name was Clay. Sorry, didn't Clay say Washington was a Templar? No. He indicated that Washington came into contact with an apple of Eden, but beyond that it's all speculation. Furthermore, judging from the portrait referenced by Clay, the event occurred much later in Washington's I don't know. Perhaps Connor wasn't even involved. It's very hard to know for sure. We'll just have to wait and see what. Hey, Desmond, didn't Subject 16. Sorry, didn't Clay say Washington was a Templar? No. He indicated that Washington came into contact with an Apple of Eden. Yeah, beyond okay. that. Whatever, I don't care. Home stretch, Desmond. I can feel it. Yeah, maybe. The tides of war are turning. The loyalists fall back beneath the advancing Patriot army. Their hold on this land weakening by the day. But the Templars only seem to grow stronger. Though fewer in number, the threat they pose appears undiminished. Making matters worse, Washington chose to spare the life of Charles Lee. I am told he has taken refuge inside Fort George, and so my days are spent searching for a way to breach its walls. Of my father, there is no trace, and I am glad of it. If I can be rid of Lee, there may still be a chance for reconciliation, and through it, peace. Oh. Now we're gonna have to make it a fort, George, somehow. Connor, he's asking for you. Oh uh, no. Don't tell me he's sick. Hello, Connor. Your sadness won't sustain me oh, any more man. than that fool woman's soups and potions. Tell me of your latest exploits. Charles Lee has been exposed and the Patriots finally rid of him. They march now to secure the remaining cities that this country might finally be free. Then you have won. The land and your people are safe. Yet you seem troubled. Washington spared Lee's life. So long as he lives, all are in danger. The so same is true for your father. When you first came to me, you understood what had to be done. Swore you'd see it through. If not for the Brotherhood, for your people, and all those threatened by the Templars. But with Lee gone, my father might... Listen to me. You have not come this far to throw it all away over misplaced sentiment. Both men must die. A Achilles. There is nothing more to discuss. <laughs> oh no.
Connor, I came as soon as I could. Tell me you bring good news. The Comte de Grasse said yes. You need only join his fleet in Chesapeake Bay and they will serve as required. But what exactly is it you intend? It's better that I show you. Charles Lee may have been dismissed, but it does not mean we are safe. But the commander? The commander underestimates the threat, and no more time can be wasted trying to convince him otherwise. I must do this on my own. Do what, exactly? Kill Charles Lee. He hides within Fort George, which is itself surrounded by a militarized district. I cannot hope to infiltrate it directly, so I will go under instead. Incroyable. The tunnels leading to the fort have been filled in. While I secure the Admiral's ships, I need you to clear them for me. And the ships? When signaled, they will bombard the fort. Breaching its walls and creating a distraction, I see. In the chaos, I will slip inside, find Charles Lee, and silence him forever. Wow. Very intuitive plan. We will try and commence this on the next part. See you guys then.